and a member of the student government at a university in California facing backlash for supporting President Trump. Here's One America's Bobby Dupree. A student senator at a private university in L.A. is facing calls for her impeachment simply for her conservative values. Stephanie Martinez is a diversity and inclusion senator for the student government at Loyola Marymount University. She was elected back in April after running uncontested, but now there are raising demands for her exit after a report by the student-run news outlet, The Agency. It attempted to expose Martinez, pointing to tweets where she expresses support for ICE and for the president's safe third country policy. Today we're sending a clear message to human smugglers and traffickers that your day is over. We'll protect the rights of those with legitimate claims and we'll end the widespread abuse of the system and the crippling crisis on our border. The story highlighting Martinez's stance on immigration also triggering attacks on social media. It even inspired an online petition calling for her resignation. As of Wednesday, it's collected over 250 signatures. Those behind the petition suggest her tweets were anti-immigrant and that she used derogatory and dehumanizing language about immigrants. That claim is taken from a tweet where Martinez uses the term illegal aliens, the petition suggesting she should have used undocumented instead. But clearly, um, speech like that is protected under the First Amendment. If today it's illegal immigrant or illegal alien. Um, tomorrow it is somebody takes offense at the word Italian-American or, or Hmong american or, 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 or fill in the blank. Um, at what point does this become a problem? In an interview with Young America's Foundation, Martinez suggested resigning wasn't an option. She said, quote, to resign would only mean that I'm giving up my identity and my ideals or that I don't believe them enough to fight. Martinez also called out the agency for demoralizing those with opposing viewpoints and distorting those viewpoints to their own convenience. Because so many millennials do tend to lean liberal. So if you don't agree with that viewpoint, keep your mouth shut. People are so concerned with making sure that their campus is very culturally diverse, but I think being intellectually diverse is something that they've kind of strayed away from. Martinez is confident she's been targeted because of her support of President Trump on a liberal campus. Loyal Marymount has yet to comment on the issue. Bobby Dupree, One American News. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One American News on YouTube and call your cable provider and kindly demand that One American News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.